Do you need more help understanding CSS layout? We get it. Layout can be one of the trickiest things to master when it comes to CSS. That's why in this new CSS layout techniques course, we'll learn exactly how to work with the various layout and positioning methods used in web design. Throughout the course, we'll build a layout using the inline, inline block, and block modes. We'll also use positioning schemes like relative, absolute, and fixed. We'll even build with Flexbox, the latest and most advanced CSS layout feature. We'll talk about all the benefits of each method, along with common layout bugs and pitfalls we may come across, and how to solve them. But that's not all. At the end of this course, we're going to learn how to create a fluid grid system using some of the layout and positioning techniques we learned about. After that, you should have a solid understanding of how all the layout and positioning methods work and interact with each other to create a layout.